China is reeling from the deadliest earthquake the country has seen in a decade. Yeah, the current death toll now stands at 126. With that number expected to rise, hundreds more are injured. Wing News anchor Chris Safadi joins us down in the newsroom. Chris, what do we know at this point? Well, Nicole and Russ, the earthquake had a magnitude of 6.2, and as you said, it's the deadliest earthquake in that country in nine years. We're going to show you some video that we're seeing coming in of some of the damage. Buildings rattling, people running for their lives here as the first shock wave spread through northwest China. The streets were flooded with people trying to escape as homes and businesses lost power. You see all the fireworkers there. The uh, lack of power made it even more difficult to find people and rescue them. According to Chinese media, the tremors lasted nearly 20 seconds and were felt more than 60 miles away from the epicenter, so a very powerful earthquake. Now watch this. You can see the moment here where diners in this restaurant start to realize something's very wrong. The restaurant, you saw it shake, and then everybody clears out the customers and the workers. Clearly figuring out at that point that there's a big earthquake going on. Rescue efforts are still in full swing right now. Some power has come back in some parts of the country, but there are parts of the country that have no power and no water, which makes not only living there very difficult, but obviously the rescue efforts even more difficult. In the newsroom for now, Chris Safadi, Wink News.